in this video, we are going to learn how to solve basic calculations involving a function. Now, after going through this video, you'll be able to solve basic calculations involving a function. So ensure you stay with me till the end of this video. Okay, so having known that, let's look at this example I have here and solve it together. So example I have here says giving f of x equals 3x squared minus 4x plus 5. Evaluate f of minus 3 and f of 5. Okay, guys, so what this thing actually means is that we have three, we have two values of x in this question rather, which are minus 3 and 5 respectively. So all you simply have to do is okay, let's get to a calculator and solve this. Okay, so all you simply have to do is to now this f of x I often say that f of x in calculus is the same thing as y so if you don't want to use f of x you can see y so instead of saying f of x equals this value 3x squared minus 4x plus 5 you can see y equals 3x squared minus 4x plus 5 so they both mean the same thing don't be confused if f of x confuses you you can be replacing it with y and it's as simple as that so let's go ahead and solve this question so this thing is is all about substitution so that's the nature of this question, not how to solve it. You just for it to substitute for x when it's minus 3 and substitute for x when it's 5 respectively. And to do that with the castle calculator, I let's store minus 3. First. Let's stop solve for x when x is minus 3. And before you do that, you have to clear your calculator. Very, very important, guys. The essence of clearing the calculator is to avoid unnecessary error. Because you might not know whether you have performed a particular calculation with the calculator previously so in order not to allow it to interfere with the one you want to do presently you have to clear so that we'll be on the safe side and to clear simply press shift button 9 when instruction want to clear all you press 3 when instruction press open press button so we have clear the calculator now next thing you have to do is to store minus 3 and do that you press number first minus story then to store, you press shift. Look at this button. I will see I look at it closely. You see ST on top of it stands for store. So you press shift the button. Then you want to store it as alphabet X. So this is X here. You press it. So once you do it, it indicates here that X has been stored as what's minus story. So having done this, press AC button to wipe it and solve the question story. So we have F of X equals to so impute the value. S square to bring out the x in the calculator, you press alpha, press then press the button, it's a comma. So you have s square dear, right? So minus 4x alpha x, press alpha x, then plus 5, plus 5. Are we missing anything? No, so that's that's what we have here. Let's press report and see what our value will be when x is minus 3. It's as simple as that, guys. Very, very simple. 44. So when x is minus 3, the function is 44. Okay, so that means we have 44. Option B seems to be the answer. But let's check when x is 5. That when x is 5, f of 5. Okay, so all you simply do now is to start x as 5. So for us to store x as 5, we have to clear so that it will not interfere with the one I want to do now to clear. Simply press shift button 9. I hope by now you have learned how to clear. Very, very simple, guys. It's important you know how to do it because it is the basic the foundation. If you don't remember it, it can spoil your work or get you the wrong value. So I've been yeah, let's store 5, you put the value first, 5, then shift, store, x, so you indicated that 5 has been stored as x, let's go ahead and substitute, so we have 3x to bring out the apple alpha x square, okay, minus 4x, that's what we have there, alpha x, okay, plus 5. That's what we have, right? So that's it, guys. Okay, press record to. That's what we have 60. So 
our option here, the correct option here is what? Option B, 45 word 60. So when F, or when S one is minus 3, the function is 40, sorry, 44. And when X is 5, the function is 60. So the correct option here, guys, is option B, 45 and 60, respectively. So this is how you can solve basic calculation involving function when you have a person of this format or of this nature, this is how you approach it and save time in the exam. Very, very simple. So, with this, guys, we are coming to the end of the class. If you are, I hope you learned something interesting. If you are new to our channel, you should subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button now for more of our videos. Also, like, share, and comment on this video to tell me how you feel regarding what you have learned in this class. If you seem to have any specific question to ask, feel free to leave a question in the comment section below and I will be sure to give you a response also check out for our other videos i have composed a good number of videos on calculator techniques or tricks so check the calculus playlist of this channel or the audible and technology playlist of this channel you will see our videos on calculator tricks or techniques on how to solve problems involving algebra and treat the metric ranging from partial fashion, quadratic equation, simultaneous equation, AP and GP, that are arithmetic progression, the rest of them, then calculate, we have integration, differentiation, we have limits, and the rest of them. So, guys, don't miss out on those very important videos. Ensure sure you check those playlists and begin to get yourself equipped with that knowledge, and you'll be glad you did. So, that's for this class, guys. Thanks for watching this video.